Hi, YouTube. <clears throat> hmm. Trying to think, where the hell was I in my last video? It's been a while. Oh yeah, I was talking about all the pets I had when I was a little kid. Um, so, I don't know, to break this down, I think, yeah, I think I said I had a kitten, I had a dog, um, and I think I was at the part, I think in the last video I was talking about that we had a dog, but I think that the next pet was that we had fish. And, uh, the fish definitely were not a good idea for my family, because nobody in my family knew what the hell they were doing at all with fish. Um, so I don't know, my mom, like one of our, my mom's cousins just gave us her fish tank that already had fish in it. Like, I don't know, she wanted to get rid of them for some reason, so she gave them to us. And she didn't even tell us what kind of fish were in the tank already, or, I don't know, she didn't tell us shit. <laughs> and then my mom, you know, <clears throat> I was only still a kid, I was like seven or eight. So I didn't really think to, you know, research about different kinds of fish, really, and neither did my mom. So um, we got this tank from my older cousin, and it already had a couple fish in it. And then my mom, as soon as we got the fish tank, my mom automatically started going out and buying more fish like crazy. Well, the bad part was that um, I remember one morning I came downstairs and uh, one of the bigger fish in the tank had one of the smaller fish in its mouth. And then, uh, you know, it was pretty shocking for me because I didn't expect that. You know, I didn't expect them to start eating each other. But, um, and then, I don't know, ever since that day, then like each day more and more fish started to disappear. They would either disappear completely or you'd find their mutilated body floating around the tank. Um, so it was pretty damn gruesome. It really was. And, um, that's when we finally found out, you know, there's different kinds of fish, like, you know, tropical fish and all the other different kinds of fish that, you know, some of them shouldn't be in the, they shouldn't be in the tanks together. And I wish that we, uh, had known that before we even tried to, uh, have a huge ass, ass, <laughs> huge ass a huge ass fish tank um, I wish we would have I wish we knew ahead of time or which my c older cousin would have told us more about what kind of fish uh, she already had in there before we went out and just bought new ones which uh, most of the new most of the ones that got eaten were the new ones that we bought so so eventually you know the fish just you know, even the ones that were eating the other ones, eventually they died, like, within a year. Because we didn't know what the fuck we were doing. And, uh, we never got fish again. So, um, I think that was back, like, in 1995, 94. I don't know. I'm not good at, like, trying to go back in time and, like, um, I don't know. I'm not good at putting moments with the exact dates and shit, but I'm trying. I don't know. I'm just guessing. <clears throat> so after the fish died, um, we didn't have another pet until 1997. Um, in 1997, we moved into a new house, and within within only a week of living in that new house, um, at night we started to hear meowing, and we don't know if the meowing was coming from under the porch or if it was coming from on the porch. We just know it was coming from somewhere around the porch. And, um, that meowing continued, uh, ever since it started, it started like a week after we moved into the new house, and it continued, like, every night, um, but we never went out there to see exactly what was going on, until, like, late October, and I remember it was like around after, after my birthday, probably like, um, well, my birthday is on October 27th, so this was probably October 29th or, or even early November. I can't remember exactly, but we just started hearing cameo. And um, ever since our fi the fish died, you know, back in 95, 
there I go trying to guess again with the date. I don't know. And the year and shit, but ever since our fish died, 95, um, I remember my mom saying, no, we are never having another pet in this house and all that shit. So anyway, I was moved to this new house in 1997, and also we hear a cat just meowing, you know, and it's like, of course it automatically um, caught my attention because, you know, even though my mom said we were never going to have another pet, um, me hearing, you know, this meowing, I still always wanted another pet, especially a, another cat. Um, and uh, so I was pretty excited, but... I still never went out. I didn't like just go right out there and see exactly, you know, what was up because, you know, I don't know. It's because my mom wouldn't let me. So, finally, okay. All right, so finally, like I said, the meowing started in sometime in October, probably early October. Then finally, on the day after my birthday, that's what I was going to say. A couple days after my birthday, that's when I, my mom happened to finally be on the porch. And she said, um, she said, there's this black cat on the porch that has uh, some long, a long-haired black cat. And as soon as she said that, I, like, got so excited. I was like, I don't know. I just got up and automatically went out on the porch. Because, you know, in my mind, like I said, I always wanted another cat. And I heard, I have heard this meowing going on. Before my mom even told me about this black cat, seeing this black cat one night on the porch. I'd been hearing this meowing before that. So um, when my mom finally told me there was a black cat on the porch with long hair, I was really excited because I just, like, I automatically had this, this feeling that, oh, shit, this must be the cat that we have, that I've heard meowing under the porch for the past week since we moved into this new house. But I wasn't sure, but I just, someone just told me, this must be the cat. It finally came up on the porch, and like, I don't know, I want to see what it looks like. So I went out there, and it was a rainy night, um, and yeah, it was a couple, it was a couple days after Halloween, so it was probably early November, now that I think about it. And, um, this black cat with long hair was standing out there, you know, with her hair soaked, and she was on the porch, but she was still wet, so that's what... And that's what kind of made me think that she came from under the porch and, you know, got a little wet in the rain when she was coming, you know, from under the porch to come up the stairs to get out of the porch. I don't know. I'm just guessing. But, yeah, so there's this black cat with long hair standing on the porch. And um, my mom, you know, just told me about it. I went out there, and, like, as soon as I seen her, I just, like, I can't remember how long I stayed out there with her. My mom, you know, just told me about it. My mom went, you know, directly back in the house. My mom didn't really like cats back then. Like I said, my mom wasn't a cat person. Um, so I went out there. I can't remember how many hours I actually spent out there. But I was out there for at least a couple hours just, like, petting the cat. Um, I, remember, I think I even went and got a towel or something and dried her off. And uh, it was almost like, it was almost like, I, I want to say love at first sight, but not in that way. It was like more of a, because um, I started thinking about like years before, like a couple of years before I always started thinking, like I always wanted a cat, okay? I love all, I love all, lots of different kinds of animals, but cats always were kind of like up there as my number one pet. And, um... I don't know like it's kind, of, it's kind of hard to explain and like I only got one more minute so I'm gonna have to like end this video here and think about more what I'm trying to say here and then like continue in the next video because I really want this to come out um, making as much sense as possible and uh, I only got a minute so and not even a minute only a couple of seconds so yeah, I gotta end the video now, and I'll continue on the next one. So, peace. Damn, that was corny. Peace.